as the Nigerian military continued to fight insecurity across various theaters of operations, some officers and soldiers has gone to the extent of paying the supreme price, leaving behind their families and loved ones. The chief of the naval staff, Vice Admiral Awal Gamburi, affirmed the commitment of the service to the welfare of the widows, families of the slain soldiers and military personnel. Naval chief made this known at the graduation ceremony of the poor skill acquisition empowerment for widows, women and youth across military barracks. He says the skill acquisition program is complement to the non-kinetic effort of the military in the empowerment of military families. I want to reassure you that the Nigerian Navy will not relent in its supportive roles towards sustaining the objectives of the various associations. Yourself and your Navy team have been exceptional in improving the welfare of these Nigerians who can never repay your progress. But the good news is that you have contributed to national security. The representative of the Chief of Defense Staff, Rear Admiral Adesheye Ayobanjo, commend the poor saying the empowerment program will aid the graduates in life of self-reliance. Skills acquisition, training and empowerment is one of the modest initiatives of the poor to contribute to the development of families of service personnel. The Defense Headquarters has always supported the initiatives of the poor, such as the establishment of the Post-Traumatic Stress Disorder Center in Abuja here, as part of efforts at ending PTSD among personnel due to the hazard in our profession. The poor president, Barista Vicky Irabo, says the empowerment program is an initiative by the association in keeping the home front. Dear graduates, People that are not in your shoes may not understand what you have achieved here. But indeed, it is the beginning of hope. It is also the expectation for a brighter and better future. A source of financial liberation and opportunity for you to equally contribute your quota to the society. Over 120 widows, women and youth were given starter kits and graduated for combined batch 12 and 13 of the POA Empowerment Program. Kike Lomo Okeri, Co. TV News, Abuja.